Hey there, you filthy animals. Mr. Dirty back with another episode of GTM Show. And today we've got yet another new item from BK. This time, it's a breakfast item. It's going to be a burrito. And they're calling this the Egg Normous Burrito. Uh, it says, wake up on the right side. And this is how they're describing this one. Featuring a generous serving of savory sausage, thick cut naturally smoked bacon, lots of fluffy scrambled eggs, golden hash brown, shredded cheddar cheese, and melted American cheese, plus a creamy spicy sauce all wrapped up in a warm flour tortilla and served with a side of picante sauce. Let's see if we actually got the picante sauce into the bag through the drive thru See the burrito. See a sticker. No picante sauce. But anywho, right off the bat, it does look pretty goddamn big. You know? It's not like the uh, the burritos that you would get at McDonald's or a couple of the other uh, you know, fast food drive through places that have breakfast. This is actually a pretty big size burrito, which it should be because this ran us $3.99 for just the burrito. And I'm pretty sure uh, I saw an advert yesterday that put this at $3. So my local BK, I guess it's just because of the area that we're in, and they don't follow any of the rules. It's like a privately owned franchise, this BK. They don't, uh, they don't take coupons. Uh, a lot of times, like, the prices don't match anything from the website whatsoever. Like, they're uh, Seattle's Best Iced Coffee. This is the Mocha Coffee. Uh, actually advertised as, I think it was $1.69. At this place, $1.89. And let's, like, look how small that is. This is what is this, like, in 12, 16 ounces, possibly? For the same price, you could walk out with, like, 24 or 32 ounces from, say, Dunkin' Donuts. Ridiculous. But back to this burrito that we're supposed to be reviewing, not the iced coffee. Matter of fact, this iced coffee, the mocha, it doesn't even taste like mocha. It tastes like a liquidized chocolate cake. So it doesn't even, you know, it doesn't even come up to the iced coffee standard. It's still pretty good, but I'd give it, like, a low 4 out of 5. Not really coffee. All right, open this up and see what we got. Okay, we got it's folded at one end and open ended over here. So we can see right off the bat the hash brown. Um, you can see that they're using like their egg beaters, their folded egg. It's not like uh, you can't see egg whites or uh, the yolk or anything like that. Just the regular like egg beater type. Shit. You can peel this back a little bit more. Okay, we do see our bacon. Our sausage, there seems to be a pretty good portion of cheese up inside of there also. We do see the American cheese right there on the flap. Uh, it's supposed to be some sort of a spicy sauce also included inside of the burrito. So maybe we don't need that picante after all. But uh, we're still, you know, we can, right now, right off the bat, say because they didn't give us the that was supposed to go with it, it's not getting a five. All right, here we go. The Egg Normous Burrito from BK. All I really got there, even though I did bite through the sausage and everything, just overwhelming flavor of like a buttery egg and the hash browns. You know, the uh, BK Crispy Crowns, I think they call them. They're damn good. So that's a plus right there. The eggs that have, have flavor, they're not like flavorless eggs like we see a lot. And the fact that we can actually taste both that and the hash browns, not bad. Let me hit it one more time because I'm getting closer to where I see like more of the cheese. Uh, more of the sausage and the bacon. Let me hit it one more time, and we're going to throw a rating on this. Alright, that's my second chomp at it. And that time around, I did get the nice, like, uh, spicy, flavorful sausage. I tasted that thick-cut bacon. That was real good. So a nice, strong, buttery egg, hash brown, sausage, bacon flavor. Can't taste any of the cheese. I have not tasted a lick of that spicy sauce that's supposed to be in here. Alright, so actually before I throw a rating on it, I'm going to bite it like right down here towards the, the bottom end and see if maybe it's all just down at one end. Who knows? Maybe I started at the wrong end. Alright? Nope. So they forgot to put the sauce inside of it as well as forgot to give us the picante sauce that's supposed to come with it without me having to request it. Now for a sausage, egg, cheese, and bacon burrito, it's pretty solid. You know, the addition of the hash browns and everything on there, that's nice. But, um, yeah, they forgot two of the ingredients that are supposed to be here. So, regardless of how good it tastes, I'm going to have to slap a 3 out of 5 on this. So I guarantee there's going to be a bunch of heaters and a bunch of motherfuckers that want to just thumbs down everything in sight. are going to hit the lower section down there. 
but I really don't give a shit. It is what it is. It doesn't matter how good this tastes as it is. It's not as advertised. They left out two ingredients, so they get two points deducted for that. It is what it is. And this is just another clear case of BK fucking absolutely failing to bring out a new product. And this BK in particular, it seems like they never know anything about the new products. You walk in, there's signage everywhere, and even the manager doesn't know their ass from a hole in the ground. They have to go in the back and make me the new product with instructions. All right, so there you have it, the BK Ignormous Breakfast Burrito. Give it a go if you're daring. I'm Mr. Dirty, this is the GTM Show. Don't forget you can buy these knucklehead t-shirts and hoodies down in the description. You can follow me on Twitter and Instagram at the Real Mr. Dirty. And as always, get out of here, go have a rotten day.